Hi guys, welcome back to another video. This week's episode, we're gonna be talking about little tips and tricks you can use uh, over the Christmas period. Like I said, uh, little tips and tricks you can do to use um, over the Christmas period. Um, I'm a person who loves Christmas. I like to eat a lot. I like to relax, see my family and friends. Um, but being a sports person and an athlete, um, it's important not to do too much of that because you're, you're still an athlete and you still need to be in training. For me, um, the new year is it's coming up fast at Christmas time. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking about what I need to do next year, my goals, what competitions I need to prepare for. So, but it's important not to be too hard on yourself at Christmas. So let yourself have that day to eat what you want, enjoy yourself. It is Christmas, it's a, a festive time of the year. So don't be too hard on yourself. But then again, remember the next day and, and the next day to, to stay motivated stay focused. So like I said, um, I feel like it's important to enjoy your Christmas day, have a blowout, eat as much as you like, be happy, it is Christmas, and no one loves Christmas more than me. Um, but for me, the next day, switch it back on, stay focused. I'm back in the training gym. Um, I like to, in this time period, I like to try and improve my flexibility and my strength. So I spend a bit more time down in the weights gym, um, making sure my body's right, for that first, that first week in January when I get back into the, the gymnastics gym. Um, I feel like it's important to be injury free um, in this t time period, um, going into the, the new year because you want to be at the top of your game. So I feel like it's important to make sure your shoulders, elbows, wrists, back, your little niggles that you might have going into the end of the year is you're over them. So you're doing the right exercises, you're building up strength for the new year. That's really important for me. and. Um, I feel like that would help uh, you guys, you little gymnasts, younger gymnasts out there to, to achieve what you want to do in the new year. Another reason why I love Christmas so much is because you are with your family, your friends and your loved ones and it's easy to, to shut off and relax and I feel like that's important over the Christmas time. And to do that every now and then because if you are so focused and obsessed with achieving your your goals and your dreams, um, it can lead to burnout and exhaustion and, and that's not good. So whatever profession you're in, whether it's sport or your own business or your job, do switch off, um, enjoy yourself, concentrate on your family and your friends. I feel like that's very important. And then uh, switch it back on soon, sooner rather than later. Um, go back to what you love doing. Um, and come back stronger and more motivated than ever. This week's question is, when did you realise you wanted to be a gymnast? Um, for me, I started gymnastics when I was six years old. I was a hyper and energetic kid um, and I have uh, three brothers. Um, so me bouncing off the walls, jumping off the sofas was a bit too much for my mum. So she threw me into the local gymnastics uh, club to get rid of some of that energy. Um, and from there, uh, I, I fell in love with the sport, really. Um, but it wasn't till back in 2008, watching um, Lewis Smith win a medal at the Olympic Games, which made me realise, OK, that's what I want to do. I want to be on, on TV. I want to go to the Olympic Games um, and win medals and be a professional gymnast. That's what flipped the switch for me and made me realise um, that I, I can turn this this uh, hobby, this thing that I do um, now and then because I enjoy doing it into um, make a career out of it and um, benefit from it. So that's the answer to that question. So guys, as you know, we release our videos every Tuesday, 6 p.m. But next Tuesday is Christmas Day. So we'll be releasing our next video on the Sunday. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe so you don't miss it. Um, I'll be giving you little uh, workout tips and exercises you can do to burn off some calories. Um, so make sure you get in contact with me via Twitter and Instagram. I love hearing your guys' thoughts and throw me some questions that you want to know. Thanks for watching.